What's going on, Ninbuzz community? Welcome back for another week of Community Choice. Sorry I missed last week. I was away on vacation, but what matters is that I'm back now and here to deliver the top five results for what is your favorite Nintendo Land attraction. So let's go ahead and get into this one. In fifth place is Pikmin Adventure with 10% of the votes. Pikmin Adventure was a pretty fun one in my opinion. I don't know, I don't think it stood true to the Pikmin series as much as I would have liked it to, but nonetheless, it was a fun one to play with friends, and actually pretty fun to play with on your own, especially if you had the Wii U gamepad. Hopefully, uh, Pikmin 3 is something like that. That would be awesome. In fourth place is Zelda Battle Quest with 13% of the votes. This one was definitely very ex expansive, very fun to play with your friends. Um, you could play with the sword with the Wii Motion Plus, kind of like Skyward Sword, or you could play with the Wii U gamepad had as a bow and arrow which is actually really fun both options are great in Zelda Battle Quest is a fantastic attraction in Nintendo Land in third place is Luigi's Ghost Mansion with 19% of the votes this was definitely the most interesting one uh, one person was the ghost and uh, the other players were uh, trying to catch it with their flashlights just like Luigi's Mansion but um, the ghost could see where everyone else was but no one sees where the ghost is, so it's very interesting. You had to catch the uh, your friends, and it w it's just a very fun attraction. It is sure it is due for some yelling and screaming and, and intense moments if you play it with your friends. Back at in third place, in second place was a fantastic attraction. I really loved was Metroid Blast. This one was just such a great shooter. Whether you played it against your friends in a third person mode or you just played on your own against the computer either way it was a really really good shooter and very like the metroid games and i was really impressed with it for just being an attraction in a game how how expansive just like zelda battle quest and how you know in depth it was how great of a game that uh that made nintendo land even though it was just part of a game that was metroid blast with 21 percent of the votes in first place was my favorite Nintendo Land attraction. Glad to see this one in first. I'm sure you guys know what it is already. It is Mario Chase with 25% of the vote. I have to say, uh, sitting down and playing this with a few of my friends was, was some of the best gaming together we've had in a long time. Mario Chase is just an extremely exciting game. You may not think so. It's just a game of tag where you tackle someone. But uh, there are so many little other factors that make it such a fun and exciting game. If you have some friends, and you have the Wii U, and you have Nintendo Land, and you have not played Mario Chase together, then what are you doing with your life? It is so much fun. I highly recommend you go do that. Mario Chase wins with 25% of the votes. Alright, let's go ahead and introduce next week's question, and that is Xerneas or Eveltal. These are the two legendaries, Xerneas for Pokemon X and Eveltal for Pokemon Y. And very little information has been revealed about them, just images and a little trailer on them. But we do know they are the mascots for the new upcoming Pokemon games in October, Pokemon X and Pokemon Y. And I just want to know, right off the bat, just first impressions, what do you guys think? What do you think is, which one is better? Uh, we don't even know the types yet. Which one do you think is cooler? Which game are you getting because of this one? If you don't know, which one do you think looks better? Just put in the comments below, Xerneas or Eveltal. I am very looking forward to uh, to finding out which one you guys like better. I'm Red Falcon Games. You can go ahead and check out my personal Let's Play channel. The link is in the description if you want to go check out an ongoing Let's Play of Pokemon Heart Gold. Other than that, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And don't forget to vote down below in the comments, Xerneas or Eveltal. I'm Red Falcon Games once again, and I hope you guys have a fantastic week.